In the closely watched local race to replace Reed Ribble's seat in Congress, Republican Mike Gallagher and Democrat Tom Nelson have been running tough campaign ads focusing on their opponent's stance on Social Security. NBC 26's Billy Wagnes joins us live at 5 with a closer look. Yeah, Holly, whether either candidate was anticipating it, Social Security has become arguably the most discussed issue in the 8th Congressional District right now, and both candidates are crying foul about what the other is saying. Now, currently, the Social Security Board of Trustees projects by 2035 taxes just won't cover the program's cost. Experts say there aren't enough young workers paying into it, but both Nelson and Gallagher agree privatizing Social Security is not an option, but Nelson is clear he's for strengthening it while Gallagher says more needs to be discussed. Well, I'm just trying to have a conversation. We just had a roundtable two weeks ago. Reed Ribble has announced a plan. I'm sitting down with him this week, hopefully, to discuss it. And so I think if we can at least start with that perspective as opposed to, you know, accusing people of this and that, then maybe we can start to identify the contours of a solution. My uh, position on Social Security has been very clear and has been very consistent. Um, I am for strengthening Social Security for this generation and future generations. Um, that's the direction we have to go. In September, PolitiFact Wisconsin said a TV ad from Nelson claiming Gallagher would had a plan that would, quote, cut Social Security benefits for two-thirds of seniors was half true. While Gallagher himself does not have such a plan, analysts say he has praised a proposal that would make those cuts. We'll have more on this Social Security debate at 10. For now, keeping you connected, Billy Wagness, NBC26.